You love your partner, but money is hard and weird. You're always asking each other, where do all our money go? You both want your money to be able to do more of the things you love for you. And that's why you're looking for the ultimate money management app for you and your partner. I mean, yeah. Okay, yeah. So before we dive in head first, I just wanna remind you that the very best budgeting app for you isn't the one that the internet tells you is the best or gets a certain award from some magazine you've never read. The best budgeting app out there is the one that works best for you and resonates with you the most. And in the spirit of finding your best money management app, rather than telling you why YNAB is the best budgeting app for you and your partner, I'll tell you why YNAB's been the best budgeting app for me and my husband. So first, Oh, what is it? The rumors are true. Yes, YNAB is both a mobile and a web-based app, but YNAB is actually far, far more than that. It's a method for money management. The YNAB method is a philosophy that changes your money mindset and gives you a concrete framework for making spending decisions. And the app? Well, that's just the tool that helps you implement the YNAB method. The YNAB method itself consists of four simple but life-changing rules. Let's break them down. Rule one, give every dollar a job. Now, I'm gonna say this and you might not believe it just yet, but budgeting isn't about restriction. It's about spending your money meaningfully. Whenever you or your partner get paid, just ask yourselves, what do we want this money to do before we get paid again? The YNAB app is like a digital envelope system. So picture each one of your budget categories as a separate envelope. Whenever you get new money, you assign that money to the budget category slash envelope slash job you want done. And we only do this with the dollars we currently have. This is a hugely key step. You might have enough dollars to divvy out to all your categories, or you may only have just enough to cover the bare essentials at first, but regardless, every dollar you make needs to be put into a category in your budget. This is called zero-based budgeting. We give every single dollar a specific job to do. On to rule two, embrace your true expenses. Your spending doesn't just stop at your monthly bills. Larger, less frequent expenses like auto maintenance and annual subscription renewals, those should be included in your monthly budget too. Car repairs, holiday shopping, insurance premiums, it's all inevitable even if we don't know exactly when it's gonna hit. But the good news, we can stop these budget busters in their tracks by breaking them down into more manageable monthly chunks that build up over time, kind of like mini savings accounts, so that whenever you need that money, it's already there just waiting for you. Fewer financial emergencies leads to less debt and more importantly, a more peaceful day-to-day -day life. Now for rule three, roll with the punches. Let me tell you, there is no such thing as a normal month. There's just not. If someone's not making spontaneous trips to the chiropractor for throwing out their back, then the car AC putters out, the guest bathroom toilet starts uncontrollably leaking, or the in-laws come to town for a whole week and your grocery receipt is about three times longer than it usually is. And that's okay. All that stuff kind of makes up the weird and wonderful beauty of life, right? Kind of. So if you end up overspending in one of your budget categories, that's no big deal. It literally happens to all of us all of the time. Remember how your budget categories are like envelopes? Well, if the grocery envelope is empty, but you need ingredients for taco night, just move some money from some other envelope into your groceries envelope. Solved, done. Budgets that don't bend break. So be flexible. It's your money, no guilt necessary, and tacos are arguably worth it, so. Which brings us to the final rule of the set, rule four, age your money. To age your money is to increase the amount of time that passes between the time a dollar enters your bank account and the time that same dollar is spent. As your mindset about money begins to change, you'll notice you and your partner feeling more purposeful with your spending and saving money just naturally starts happening in the background. Like four months ago, you didn't even have a compartment in your brain for car repairs and now you have $600 set aside just for that. We call that leveling up. Eventually, you'll be able to cover next month's bills with the money you earned last month, and this is what we want. The initial goal is to age your money to 30 days, but trust me, if you stick to these four rules, you're gonna find that that buffer just continues to grow and grow and grow. Knowing that you've got next month's expenses covered will bring you such a sense of security and relief and confidence. I bet my best pair of shoes on it. These four rules are what helped my husband and I go from single dorks who had no idea how to manage our money to newlyweds who spent most all of our money on our wedding because we wanted to, to rebuilding our finances and buying a house <clears throat> all in the same year. 
Since then, we have nearly wiped out all our consumer debts, minus the mortgage, go figure. And our net worth has increased month over month. And it ain't too shabby of a feeling, I will tell you that. So, back to my point, it works for me and my husband, but will it work for you and your partner? Well, here are five main reasons YNAB has been so great for us, just a few telltale signs that YNAB might be a great fit for you and your partner too. Sign number one, if you want to share a budget while also having the option to create other budgets. YNAB Together is a slick hub of the app that allows for you to share your subscription and all the budgets of your choosing with a loved one, making it 100% ideal for managing a household budget or a shared expenses budget, even if you and your partner don't share a joint bank account or combine your finances. And you're free to make as many budgets as you'd like. Your partner can make one that manages income and expenses for their small business, Business, you can make a shared budget that organizes all your costs for your upcoming wedding, or you could even plan a home renovation budget. That's a lot of handy budgets right there. Sign number two, YNAB is for you if you want to get diligent about paying down debt. Car loans, mortgages, credit card debt, student loans, debt happens to all of us, it's fine, you fit right in here. You can get out of debt and stay out with YNAB, and it's like actually pretty neat. Use our loan planner to experiment with different debt payoff plans to see how much time and money you can save by making additional payments or bumping up your payoff date, which is exactly how we paid off LASIK, an engagement ring, almost one whole car, and planned a whole wedding without ever going into debt or borrowing money. And the bonus you were secretly hoping to hear, YNAB is also set up so that you can continue using credit cards because yes, you better believe I'm gonna keep milking that cashback system without accruing any new debt. The app automatically moves money from your spending categories and into your credit card payment category so that when it comes time to pay the credit card in full, you have literally every single dollar you need sitting in your credit card payment category just dying to pay off your bill for you. Sign number three, YNAB is definitely for you if you wanna make and meet spending and savings goals. As you create your budget, you have the option to set spending and saving targets to each of your budget categories. This makes it so simple to decide how to divvy up your paychecks and make sure you have enough money set aside for all your upcoming expenses. Because YNAB always knows which category is the next most important category to fill based on your due dates, your savings goals, and how much money you've already spent. One of my favorite parts of YNAB are the progress bars that let us know exactly where we stand with each category by showing us how close we are to meeting each of our goals. YNAB does all the math, thank goodness, and tells you how much you need to contribute to each category and buy when. So when it's time to buy those Disneyland tickets on Black Friday, you are ready. If that's a thing, I don't even know, I've never been. Four, YNAB is the app for you if you want an easily accessible way to visualize your finances. Picture this, your partner is at Target, again, and there's a sale on hearth and hand stuff, AKA kryptonite. They don't need to call you and ask if they can buy the perfectly chic placemats for all the dinner parties you host, or guiltily hide their Target bags in the trunk until you leave the house, they can just check the mobile app, available for Apple and Android, and see if there's any money in the home decor category. Their answer is literally right there. And actually, they don't even need to open the app if they've got a YNAB widget on their home screen, a way to easily peek in on your top one, three, or seven categories of choice. And if you wanna know something like who spent more on takeout this month, or you're looking for an easy way to track deductible expenses so tax time isn't a receipt searching nightmare, use Using YNAB's customizable flags on your transactions makes it super easy to search up just the info you're wanting. And if you're just a net worth fanatic like myself, or just want to know if you've actually spent more on groceries this year than you did last year, like we're all afraid we did, our reports tab provides an easy and fascinating way to dissect your spending data, which comes in extra handy during tax season. And lastly, YNAB is for you if you are ready and willing to do the work, but might need a little help. Change takes effort. No one runs a marathon or knits a sweater without practice, and budgeting is literally easier than both of those things. So you totally have it within you to do this, and while you're learning, we have all the tools you could ever possibly need along the way. 
trust me. And the more hands-on you are with your budget, the more successful you'll be. All you really need is to spend a few minutes each week managing your budget. That's what keeps you focused, accountable, and accurate. And hey, if you like date nights, we also recommend scheduling a regular budget meeting date night with your partner because managing your money, believe it or not, can actually be fun and doing it together helps keep everyone invested in the outcome of your income see what I did there. Like finances, but make it flirty. I personally love seeing all my dreams come closer and closer to becoming reality over a glass of wine, cheese cubes, and strawberries. And I can do it in my pajamas and no eyeliner. So who's the real winner here? Now, we know budgeting doesn't come naturally to everyone, and it certainly isn't a one-size-fits-all kind of deal. I mean, that's, that's why you're watching this video right now. So we offer a ton of material to help you learn in whatever way works best for you. We have a whole hub of resources to help you learn how to budget as a couple, a massive video library, podcasts, guides, blogs, live workshops, open Q&A sessions, customer support, a killer monthly newsletter, savings challenges, and active social media communities and it's all free. So if you and your partner are ready to try YNAB, maybe not commit, but just try it, dip your toes, start with our free 34 day trial. There's no commitment or credit card required and it won't turn into one of those zombie subscriptions where we charge you every month while you're not looking until eventually you notice and then we make you jump through 19 hoops to cancel your subscription. Oh, we hate that. <laughs> We don't do that. In fact, I'll give you a great starting resource. This blog post linked below in the description is chock full of videos and screenshots that'll help you learn how to set up your YNAB budget and get your partner to participate so that you both start on an even playing field. If you wanna start off with an even deeper discussion with your partner about finances, feelings, and goals, sign up for our free downloadable DIY budget planner and our Change Your Money Mindset email series. It's five short, inspiring emails that explain the YNAB method accompanied by a printable workbook that helps you get familiar with your current finances, your future goals, and your relationship with money. And honestly, it's mega helpful whether you decide to use YNAB or not, even though, of course, we hope you do. A healthy relationship is like building a house. Sure, you can slap up a pretty facade fairly quickly, but taking the time to draw up plans, build a solid foundation and prioritize what really matters will result in a home that you can love and will last for a lifetime. Flexible and understanding money management is like the load-bearing wall that the rest of the house is built on, relies on. And YNAB can help you stress less about spending while helping you spend more on what really matters to you both. So if you're ready to make financial decisions that feel good and learn to love the way you spend your money, start your free trial today. Your future selves will thank you. Thanks for joining me today and I'll see you in the next video. Taking spontaneous trips to the chiropractor for, I keep saying chiropractor. What do they do? Oh no. Oh geez. Oh no. Bro, you hit your head one time. My dress is literally hurting my elbow skin. Why can't I speak like a normal person? I just want to speak like George Washington. Two more times. This line will be the death of me, but at least I'll die satisfied.